listen i know this isn't your regular podcast you listen to but listen yeah uh thanks for listening to us we really appreciate that just two boys who have no idea how to set up mics doing <laughs> doing a great job so far <laughs> doing, doing doing a damn good job damn good damn job, good job. <laughs> at least at least we think so yeah I, i'm sure our parents think so too yeah my my mom's real proud uh so folks uh I have started a new project that I would like to share with you today. Um, I have actually started my very first, you know, like parody uh, Twitter account is called Doug Ford Can Suck. <laughs> so the reason why I have started this account is because um, just, you know, very recently, uh, Doug Ford has been doing like some, some pretty bad stuff. Uh, he's... Uh, just to like put it in layman's terms, how he's affecting the teachers is going to affect my job as well. Uh, so uh, yeah, elaborate a little bit because like I feel like I'm out of the loop a little bit here too. Yeah, yeah. So uh, the discussion is right now uh, with all the cutbacks, with like everything, making like larger class sizes for like one teacher. Uh, he took out funding for autistic children for their Ooh. supports. Um, yeah, just like, this is just one side of the coin. This mm -hmm. is just the education. There's so much more that he's done. But like, <coughs> the discussion is, it's kind of like Nova Scotia, how, but it's actually worse. Um, so like, you know how like our teachers protested, then they went to work to rule for like a year. Yeah, yeah. It's going straight to work to rule. Damn, really? Yeah. Ooh. Uh, and what that means is there's no extracurricular activities. And my job, is an extracurricular activity for schools. Oh, shit. Yeah, so it's going to have a big impact on me, uh, the whole shebang I work for. Uh, and I just, you know, got pretty mad about it. I thought I'd take to Twitter in my very own little special way. And I started this account. Uh, the Twitter handle is Doug Suck. Uh, <laughs> Doug Suck. Doug Suck. Follow it. Uh, our bio. When I say ours, I mean mine. Unless you want to get in on it, feel free. But it's daily tweets, period. Doug Ford sucks, period. You can choose what he sucks on, comma, DM us. So, I have two tweets out. One of them has a like. Uh, first one is, Doug Ford can suck a chode. Second, <laughs> Doug Ford can suck a cactus. Oh. Cactus emoji. Would you like to add anything? <coughs> Damn. Doug Ford can suck. Okay. Hit me with anything. Me? Yeah. Oh, Doug Ford can, can suck. Oh, jeez. That's well, pretty gross. Ooh. Um, can suck a... Just say, can suck a fart. Ooh. <laughs> suck a fart. That also, Turkish shotgun in there. Yeah. I'm also doing, like, a Jaden Smith style of tweets where all the words are capitalized. Like, capital letter Ooh. for each... Okay. Of each word. Uh... I have one follower, uh, is Jess. <laughs> nice. See, I, you told me about it, when was it, this morning? Last night. Last night. I didn't follow you yet. Yeah. I will actually right now. Oh, wonderful. Or after this podcast, I will. Wunderbar. Yeah. Um, yeah, I, I, like, I started Snapchatting a bunch of people I knew. I was like, hey, do you have Twitter? What are your thoughts on Doug Ford? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I only Snapchat three people. I got three responses from each of them. Uh, Jess was the only one that followed, but everyone else thought it was a funny idea. One of them gave me the suggestion for the cactus, which is very good. But yeah, uh, just overall. I like that. I like this. Thank I'm you. I'm going to retweet that. Uh, wait, I'm, what What Twitter am I on? I got to find out what Twitter account I'm on. Ooh, okay. Oh, I'm on mine. Okay, good. Good, good. Don't want our brand affiliated with it. Also, if this like turns into this big thing and like Doug Ford has people like the NSA searching for me. FBI, open up! Hey, I'm a 21 year old kid who has a job uh, and you're directly affecting it and you're affecting a lot of people not just me you're affecting your kids you're affecting the teachers uh, and you're not doing a good job so I know a majority of Ontarians voted for you and I am still technically a Nova Scotian but hey man Doug Ford sucks <laughs> is that an audio spike yeah it was this Fuck you, is Doug. the political Nobatoba podcast we're getting into politics now. Oh yeah, just two straight guy, straight white guys talking about politics, aka what? 
podcast. Hasn't been done before. Has this never is all been done. new, revolutionary. New revolutionary technology. <laughs> but anyways, that was that was all a plug for my uh, Twitter account. There was nothing else <clears> to it. Not even gonna plug our our own. Nobatoba oh, yeah, follow Twitter. us at Nobatoba Band. <laughs> no, yeah. <laughs> On Twitter, it's Nobatoba Band. Okay. Everywhere else, it's just Nobatoba. Wonderful. Oh, I got a new follower. Who followed me? Oh, that was me. <laughs> Ooh, like I said, I was going to follow. I do what I say. I'm a man of honest thought. Honest thought. Honest words. Honest thought. Honest thought, Tiana. Honest thought, Tiana. <laughs> gang, gang. Gang, gang. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> But yeah, um, I didn't start the stopwatch. Oh, <coughs> oh man! It's been going for four minutes. Four minutes. Do you yeah. have a stopwatch? No, but I. It was two eleven when we started this. Oh, wonderful! Yeah, four minutes. Oh wow! I think I don't know. It probably says it on the thing. Oh, does it say on the thing? Does it say I don't know if you have it on. Oh, yeah. Dude. Oh yeah, it's like saying six oh five. Oh shit! Okay, Great. a lot longer than I thought. All right. Okay. So. Um. Oh, you were talking about uh, Doug. And I was going to say something, and I completely forget what it was. Was it fuck you, Doug? Uh, I think it was. Fuck you, Doug. Oh, good one. <laughs> very nice, very nice. <laughs> All right. But yeah, that's, that was my story for the, the podcast. Do you have anything else? <laughs> oh, oh that's, that's what you had? Oh, yeah, but I have more. Okay. Well, I just wanted to say, also... I've I've been I've been getting really into <laughs> that applause was for nothing. Um, I was getting I'm getting really into F1 Formula One racing. Oh yeah. Yeah. I don't know if I was talking to you about this the other day. I, was, I think I was trying to while we were gaming. Okay. And then I didn't really get any worse with it. Oh true. But uh, <clears throat> yeah no I watched the the series on Netflix the Formula One race to survive or drive to survive. Ooh, that true. sounds like it, that's what it is because it rhymes. Drive to drive. Um, drive to drive. Ride to ride. Ride or die. Ride or die. Ooh, I have skate or die. About Formula I One, skate or die. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, anyway. And so I've been getting really into that. It was the 2018 season that they, they kind of recapped in that. And it was really good. And, like, like it makes me really like F1. And I really want to buy F1 merch. They have a Ferrari watch at the Bay. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Anyway. And Lance Stroll, Canadian from Quebec. He does. He races for Racing Point mm -hmm. right now for the 2019 season. They recently just had the Australian Grand Prix. Yeah. Um, he finished ninth in that, which is which is pretty all right out of 20. Yeah. Um, so that's pretty all right. Um, and uh, yeah. Anyway, then there's a new. There's another Grand Prix. I can't pronounce it. Bahrain, Bahrainian, Bahrain, something. Bohemian. No, not Bohemian. Rhapsody. Yeah, yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> that that's that's very soon. So I'm gonna take this. It's on a Sunday also. Ooh. So I'm gonna. I have the Sunday off. So it's gonna. I'm gonna sit down. It's at 11 a.m. But I don't care. I'll get up and watch it because I've been waking up super early oh anyway. So I'm gonna get up, make a good breakfast, watch watch stream the F1 the Grand Prix. Oh my god, I it's can, gonna be nice. I can picture it now. Yeah, you're gonna be there. You're gonna wear some. Uh, some boating shoes, oh, like kind of like damn. moccasins, but like the blue ones. Yeah. Uh, you're going to have on like your little little white boy cardigan. Uh, you're gonna have some eggs Benny for breakfast with mm -hmm. a little Corona. Ooh. <laughs> Maybe a mimosa, honestly. Wow. Damn. Yeah. No, but the <laughs> the whole, it's like it's such a flex to I feel like <laughs> <laughs> to like be really into F1 there's a lot of rich Europeans <laughs> into F1 one. you know yeah. no but you know like it's a big flex going, like I want to go to Monaco I want to see I want to see the Grand Prix there because it's so nice there's just yachts in the harbor yeah like it's it's insane yeah. like the amount of rich people there there's famous actors and stuff yeah. also one of the Grand Prix I forget which one it was I think it was in Korea yeah I think I feel like it was last year Will Smith waved the opening flag and it was it was insane my good man the best youtuber yeah. Will Smith Aww. anyway I really want to go see an F1 race I like mean. this year next year sometime I, I really want to like it's in my it's in my books oh for like you know? within the next year I hope so that'd be nice you're gonna save up like enough money to go from to Europe next year uh, I don't know we'll see like that that There's, was that's kind of like kind of condes, condescending no, but like, no I know what you mean but like I like cause I do have other trips planned like I want I gotta go back to Nova Scotia well I'm going back to Nova Scotia Canada Day week cause with my new job I got a new job everybody woo <laughs> I'll be working in a factory um I plan to go down there for Canada week cause we, I get it off with work oh, uh, to Nova Scotia Scotia and then for Christmas 
I really want to go to Cuba or somewhere is warm. What the fuck? Yeah. That's sick. So, like, we'll see. Because, like, Cuba and down there is, like, super cheap compared to, like, going to Europe, right? Oh, it's true. It's, it's like, true. less than a thousand bucks. Like, seven, eight hundred bucks, all paid for. I do have a question about that. Would it be just you? Would it be your family? Would it be the, your partner? Um, I we were talking about like to nova scotia or to like, cuba oh why not both both um well for for nova scotia i'm definitely going to take my partner down nice we're going to go down there um because i want to show her everything and meet my parents and stuff which would be nice yeah um <clears throat> and then for cuba i was thinking the same thing depending like I'm, like i'd also like for a bunch of friends to come you know oh 100 percent. because that would be really great like as much like as i would like to just relax and like be with her and stuff i think it'd be really fun if like a bunch of my friends came nice so like if like you came if like Bless our other you. friends i'm not going to name anybody yeah actually we named jess so jess can come <gasps> and dugga can come oh dugga dugga and then i don't know i don't know any other friends dugga dimadome yeah can we call him dimadome dimadome yeah okay Doug, Doug a dimmer dome. Home of, <laughs> home of the dome. Home of the dimmer dome. Dig a dome. Dig a dome. Dig a dome. Dig a Anyway, trips on trips. And then if I have money left over, I feel like I won't. But yeah, it'll it'll definitely be 2020. Yeah. Because, like, the season just started. Oh, yeah. So I think they have, I think they get, like, three months off or something. Yeah. Um. So, like... It, it ends at like Christmas or like before then okay and then they also have one in the states they have the American Grand Prix Ooh. or the oh true the America's Grand Prix I don't know what they call it cause like yeah. yeah so I'm that'd be I need a passport first before I go traveling but oh, good one. they have that I feel like it's such a divide too between like I was like oh we saw the racing like NASCAR oh, I was yeah. like oh it's like it's, it's a completely different culture. it is it's so different yeah like the way they design their cars, like the F1, like they spend so much money and it's so, it's so neat, you know? Neat. It's like all these different brands and the motor, like manufacturers and stuff. It's really like, it's insane. It's insane. I like it a lot. And the drivers, like once you get to like watch this series and get to know the drivers, yeah. like you get to know the personalities and like, it's really cool in their backstories and I really like that. Yeah. Well, um, my stepfather, he was a, is a huge nascar fan mm -hmm. he he loves it to death um yeah there's like there's that whole backstory thing but like you have to like dig for it a bit more it's not just like a netflix yeah. documentary it's yeah. like uh like he has sirius xm he listens to like just nascar talk shows all the time Damn. yeah because he's a truck driver and that's literally all he listens yeah. to so he knows like everything about it it's insane oh my god yeah like the, the, all the trades, different brand deals. Whoa! Oh, that's that's like that's something that's really cool. Like NASCAR is like I can respect it. Yeah. But like I don't think I'd ever get into NASCAR per oh. se because yeah. it's very American and plus like their courses are always a circle. It's in a circle. And no, an oval. Sorry. An oval, you know. But like With it's a, like forty-five degree like kind of yeah. angle. But yeah. And like I know like I always used to say before I like started watching like stuff you know yeah. i'd be like people only watch it for the crashes yeah and like to a degree some people do but oh, i mean <clears throat> but i mean like f1 there's like turns not just left-handed oh. turns there's turns. turns yeah you know i do know and that's so cool like it's a different aspect to racing it is and like it always kind of looked before i started watching more of it i thought it was so uniform like they started out in a spot and then they barely passed anybody and stuff and like there's yeah. barely any accidents in f1 but there's like a lot of shit happens oh, 100%. it's intense yeah and like sometimes like like things will happen to their cars and they're all like computerized right so they know yeah. exactly what's going on yeah it's insane and there it's isn't there's a lot going on like 100 i can't wait to, i just can't wait to get into it more yeah you know yeah uh one of the people i work with he's an older man he kind of looks like my uh, stepfather uh we had to like write bios about ourselves for work um i thought he would be like a total nascar guy he's a f1 guy yeah he really loves f1 it's insane uh Ugh. it's something that like he's really into um yeah it's like damn yeah oh man i i can't wait to get into it more yeah. um also bring this up since i'm talking about f1 i was looking at getting a new phone yeah um and i'm really thinking about getting the the one plus six t um so you know what i mean by the one plus the one plus 60 isn't that 61 it's the seven the one plus seven the one plus oh, 6 one t. plus the one plus six t 61 
Because <laughs> <laughs> right six T sounds like sixty. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. <laughs> okay, I didn't get it. Um. Anyway, but they have for that one. They have a uh, McLaren edition out. So F1 McLaren, and they have this really <laughs> yeah. But it has ten gigabytes of RAM. Ten gigabytes of RAM. On a phone. Uh, on a phone. Guess how many gigabytes your computer has that you just told me about? Eight. Eight. <laughs> <laughs> this phone has ten gigabytes of RAM. How big is it? Like the size it's, of it's like, it's, no, it's like the size. <laughs> <laughs> it's like the size of my phone, but like, it's insane. And it's it's like, it's less than a thousand dollars. It's like nine fifty, right? But plus tax, I mean, it's over a thousand dollars. But listen, I'm listening. But they don't have it. They don't have it in their shop anymore. I was looking at it. It came out in December, but they don't have this edition anymore. I couldn't find it on their shop. But they have it on Amazon, but I don't want to buy it from Amazon because it's like $300 more than it, what it came out for, right? Yeah. So I'm kind of like really deterred to buy that or just like the new Google Pixel or like a, the new Sony Xperia because like I really want this McLaren phone though. <laughs> I really want it. That's fair. I really want it. I think it's obtainable. Uh, like I hope they release it again because like I really want it. Yeah. Yeah. I I'll, Speaking of new phones, mine is a piece of garbage. I've had it for like have for a really long time. I think it's going on three years now. What? Okay, what phone do you have? I have the Samsung... Oh, wait, maybe it might have been replaced. Uh, but right now it's the Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge. <laughs> they have the 10 out now, don't they? Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. They and release phones like crazy, though. They, yeah, everyone releases phones like crazy. <coughs> I remember iPhone, like, very recently came out with iPhone 9, then right after iPhone X, like, two months later or something. Yeah. Wait, did they release a 9, or is it? did it go from 8 to 10? 8 to X? Oh, I think it went from 8 to X. Yeah, it did. You're right. Shit. Yeah, fuck. They were, they jumped the gun. They jumped the gun. But, uh, so, yeah, mine, mine's like, it's good, but like, it's technology nowadays made to like degree, it took a whole course about it in like high school. Mm -hmm. It's made to like die. There's a lifespan. On yeah, it. yeah. My phone, I have a Sony Xperia Performance. Yeah. And, uh, and like, I just, it's, it overheats. When I use it, it like it gets really bad. The yeah. camera will shut off if I'm if I'm filming things. Yeah. It'll overheat and be like, "Hey, it's this needs to shut off because it's way too fucking hot." Yeah. And like summer days, I can barely use it. It it lags so bad. Yeah. It was really good when I first got it, but it's just. Yeah. Cause yeah, yeah what they do is like, it's mostly the hardware that's given a shelf life. Mm -hmm. So like your phone will overheat, but uh, also this was like a big thing in the news a few years ago that apple like with every update like made the software like degrade a bit more so they would have to get the new phone it was really yeah it was a really big thing but uh yeah so my phone mm. thankfully has no like real hardware issues except for like the camera but like i broke that myself that's yeah that's a me bad but uh like the hardware itself is fine uh the thumbprint scanner's getting a bit chippy so mm -hmm. but Again, yeah. that's that's my fault. I don't take like the best maintenance with it. That's fair. My uh my headphone port, the the three and a half thing, it's it's going out. Yeah. It gets really crackly, like when I turn it and stuff, it's really bad. Yeah. And my charging thing's going too. So I, I yeah. I'm in, definitely in the market for a new phone. Yeah. <clears throat> like sometimes I just I wish like sometimes I hope when I drop it that it, the screen is broken because yeah. then it'll give me an excuse to go and get a nice phone yeah. or like spend a little money you know that's but fair. I just I, if it's still working like it's still fine it works enough for me to use it's not cracked or anything yeah. and, then, and then it kind of deters me to be like well my other phones that I got rid of were in a worse state than this you know I feel like I should keep it until it's like dead Yeah. but at the same time I just I want a new phone oh for sure because I'm so out of date yeah yeah this is, this is bad but yeah where are we at I don't know we're at 19 minutes. Oh shit. Yeah. Okay. So I have a I have a couple urban dictionary things here I want to read you. All right, let's go for it. <clears throat> Just a couple, okay, to end it off. Brand new game time. Let's go. Oil rig. What's an oil rig? Listen, besides I'll, I'll, I'll be honest, I don't actually know what a real oil rig is. No. Is, like, is it like a ship? Or is it like a big crane oh, in the no. ocean? Oh no. It's like a big crane in the ocean. Okay. It's like a it's like a platform with big things that they said in the okay. ground yeah like i knew what it was when i was 12 but like i haven't really cared to yeah anyways oil rig uh so oil probably something brown <coughs> something dirty something involving poop definitely uh, is okay rig yeah do you want to do you want to guess or like i'm gonna take like, a quick guess okay. and you can tell me uh rig 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 
Jeez, I actually don't know. No? Okay. I know it involves poop. Yeah, it definitely does. It's the act of being upside down and squirting diarrhea in the air. <laughs> <laughs> that makes sense. Yeah. So if it's I like... an actual oil rig was. The, uh, the intro to the Beverly Hill Hillbilly is kind of like that, you know? But, I mean, an oil rig's different. They're like an offshore thing. But True. Same thing, right? Okay. A love puff. You know what a love puff is? A little kiss. A little, the little kiss, but not. Um... It's called is it is it a queef? Nope. Okay. That uh, to to like put some rationality behind that. <clears throat> uh, vaginas, people love them. <clears throat> Puff, you know. A little yeah, yeah, yeah. That's I. Well, good guess. Um, here's the sentence. A oh, whoopsie! I did a little love puff. It's a queef? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> what is it? Okay, it's a silent fart released whilst in bed with your partner. Whilst a queef. No, a silent fart. It doesn't say that. It's the same thing. As a you, I, you could say that. I don't know. Yeah. It, just doesn't, it doesn't specify, I guess. Puff. It doesn't specify. Yeah, it's a queef. Okay. Okay. Um, by calling it a love puff, you hope to maintain some level of cuteness and overcome the curse of the bad smell that threatens to ruin an overwise, otherwise romantic moment. So, okay. like, it's like okay. if they, if they like, That's a fart. realize, yeah. Yeah. Okay. You got me. You know what I mean? You got me. Um, okay, we'll do one more. One more. One more. Sound good? One. Close it out. All right. Okay. Ugh. Clitty litter. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Take your guess. Oh, my God. Oh, wow. I okay. don't want to. Hang Here. on. Give me a second. Okay. Oh, are you going to use the sentence? Well, the sentence gives it away. Oh, so, like, God. I can use the sentence if you want, but I'll, I'll give it anyway. Yeah, I'll give it. Yeah? Yeah. All right. Here's the sentence. When I was performing cunnilingus, I found pink toilet paper. So, it's residual toilet paper around clitoris. Oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> pink toilet paper. Fuck. AKA clitty litter. That's amazing. All right. Well, I think that's a wonderful note to end it on. That's litty. Um, yeah. Bye. Thank oh. oh, no. Oh, oh. 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 O